Miami-Dade teachers held a planning day today ahead of Monday's staggered return to in-person learning. And for some, it was the first time back in the classroom since the pandemic began. CBS 4's Jessica Vallejo has more. These images show what Miami-Dade school students will see, and that's a security checkpoint, cafeteria tables spaced out, teachers in masks, and sanitation supplies. Students will walk in one direction, and there will also be an isolation room for health reasons if needed. By Zoom, Myra Mora shows us her classroom at the Irving and Beatrice Pesco K-8 Center in Homestead, where she has set up social distancing for her students that she has not seen in months. The preoccupation that myself and many teachers have is just safety. She knows she will have to accustom her students to the new norm. I would tell them to welcome back. We're happy to see you. Um, it's not going to be the same as it was, you know, six months ago. This is our new normal. We have to wear our masks, keep our distance. Under the staggered reopenings on Monday, those in pre-K, kindergarten, first graders, and students with disabilities can return to the classroom. On Wednesday, October 7th, all other elementary students, plus those in grades 6, 9, and 10, may also start. On October 9th, all other students will be allowed to return. School Superintendent Alberto Carvalho urges parents to check their children every morning for symptoms. A fever over 100.4 degrees Fahrenheit, cough, shortness of breath or difficulty breathing. And to help families, students can also receive thermometers. These will be distributed by individual schools in the coming weeks. And again, for those students who opted back in July for in-person learning, can continue their learning online. In downtown Miami, Jessica Vallejo, CBS4 News, tonight.